everybody and welcome to let's play kingdom kingdom is a brand new game that just came out yesterday and i have been so hyped and excited to play this game you don't even know a lot of youtubers and streamers got early access to it about a week ago and i've been just so excited to get my hands on it ever since then but if you've never heard of it and have no idea what kingdom is it is essentially a 2d kingdom builder resource management type game resource management isn't quite the right word or genre but it's it's so much fun oh, i love it so much so basically you just start out with nothing and you basically just throw money at everything to fix your problems so we threw money at these two guys here and they are now a part of our village we're gonna go ahead and turn one of them into an archer so we just bought a bow for him and then we're gonna buy a hammer over here and we're gonna turn one of them into a builder so the builder will come over here and what I paid for over here was a wall so he's gonna come over here and build us a wall and then we're gonna run over to the other side here and we are going to build ourselves another wall so that way we have two walls for the night during the night monsters will come out and attack your village which is not fun but the first couple of nights are super easy so we pretty much just need those two walls let's go ahead this is a little campsite where you can recruit new people into your kingdom and so we just threw money at one dude and recruited him into our kingdom he's gonna slowly walk over here and he will join us right now I don't have any money I don't have any more money oh and there we go uh, and what will happen the ways that you can get money is that when archers go out and kill animals they will gain money from that have you killed anything ah you have killed something and this archer is in the process of killing this bunny but he really really sucks wow you are terrible <laughs> so the more archers that we have the better though so we're gonna go ahead and this new guy we just recruited we are gonna make him an archer as well and since we didn't have enough money before to grab this guy, we're going to grab him now. You're hiding behind your tent. I see you. Okay, he is now part of our village. And I don't believe, I think we only have one gold or one coin. I don't think we can make another bow. No, we cannot. But I think we are good for tonight. I think we'll be able to make it through just fine. But definitely want to get more archers as soon as possible so that way I can be getting more monies up in here. So if you don't have a steady income of money in this game, you're pretty much screwed. Archers are a really good source of income at the beginning of the game. But as you get further along, they become like less reliable. Some days they won't get any money at all for you so then what you have to do is you have to get farms so we kind of need to keep our eye out for where a farm is here is one of them the little waterfalls kind of signify where farmland are so there's one but it's a little far away and i think we'll probably end up waiting until daytime to figure out where another farmland is or we can just go out now you know and there's another farmland right there um i think they're they're both just about as far away from each other but i think what we're gonna do is during the daytime we're gonna kind of scout them out we're gonna see which one has the best defense around it whether they have just walls or just archer towers or both walls and archer towers that one being the best case scenario but once it becomes daytime see if we can catch one of these monsters in the act here's a monster the first night i think only one or two attack and are you serious are you serious dude you are it's so bad so bad how are you missing him oh my god is he really gonna get through this wall thank you you are a terrible archer and uh, you can see this wall is a little bit damaged too you can't really tell because it's a little dark but this wall is damaged as well so there was a monster over here like i said i think only two come out the first night but as you get deeper into the game even more come out so each day after the night you get a little chest that pops up here and it will give you money we're gonna go ahead and upgrade this here and then uh, do we want to upgrade walls let's go ahead and check out what is around these farmlands so there's a wall there but it doesn't really look like there's much defense outside of the farmland so let's go ahead oh that's the dumb logo if you go all the way to the left there's a kingdom logo and it's like after a while all of a sudden it'll make that sound and it's really confusing oh our flag is so awesome looking our flag is so awesome i've never seen that one before it's like a three-headed dragon thing that's awesome looking okay that's cool 
let's go ahead and get these walls upgraded as well now that I'm uh, done getting excited over my kingdom flag and let's see what the defenses are over here so this rock over here shows us that there is oh that guy was really good I'm gonna grab that guy this rock shows us that there's an archer tower there but I'm not seeing we're gonna grab this guy come back with us please and are there any villagers over here? There's one, there's another one. Okay, come. Come, come. Come join my kingdom, my beautiful kingdom. But I'm not seeing anywhere where there could be a spot to put a wall. Which isn't that great. Because uh, I would like to keep a campsite near me, if possible. So we'll have to see. There can be little... You can tell where a wall will go because there's like a little lump of dirt. And there could possibly be a lump of dirt hiding behind a bush or something. So uh, we're going to grab these guys as well. So that could possibly be where another wall is. But before we get concerned with that, I think we will build... Oops, we'll build another wall here. Which is actually a really bad idea to do that right now because it's almost nighttime. But that's cool. We're going to keep this wall the way that it is currently. We'll go ahead and get an archer tower here. And I think we're going to expand more to the left because I'm liking the way the defenses for this farm over here are looking rather than the one to the left. So I think what we're going to do is we're going to wait until... Uh, oh good, he did get the wall done in time. Thank you, builder dude. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I think what we're going to do is we're going to wait until nighttime has passed. And we're going to wait till tomorrow and we'll chop down this tree, which will get rid of this campsite. And then we'll continue chopping down these trees over here and just seeing exactly what's over there. And just seeing if we want to use that farm first or if we want to use the other one. So this donkey dude, I don't think I explained what he does. So we gave him four coins and what he did is he came over here and he filled up one of our stations. And I actually don't know what station he filled up. Um, they took all of them already, but what he'll do is he'll come to one of the stations and oh good He finished the archer tower. He'll fill up one of the stations. So he'll give us um, Like three hammers three or four hammers and four bows just one or the other though And uh, he'll completely fill that up for only four coins Which always ends up being cheaper than what it would be if you made them manually. Oh God so much money. Thank you. Thank you for the money during the daytime, so we're going to chop down those trees. We're also going to upgrade this wall because this wall sucks. And then, uh, let's see here. I think we will probably also get this archer tower up as well. Um, this seems fine for now, but I'm definitely going to upgrade that during the day, I think. Okay, let's go ahead. We're going to throw many at these trees. We're gonna get them chopped down. I will grab you, sir. And I don't think we can chop these. Yeah, we can't chop these down until this tree is gone. Then we'll get rid of the campsite and then we can chop these trees down. So we kind of have to wait for that. And then let's get this stuff upgraded. I'm assuming that the donkey dude gave us bows because I'm not seeing a ton of builders anywhere. So we're gonna go ahead and get another builder. So we should have two now. And that will obviously up the building speed a little bit. So we'll go ahead and get that upgraded. And then, oh, okay. The one thing that I don't like about this game is the stamina for the dang horse. So you can only run for a certain amount of time. And then the horse gets tired. But the horse just gets tired so fast. And it's so irritating. <laughs> it takes so long. Okay, let's see where the nearest wall is. That I can see. Okay, here is the next nearest wall, which is a ridiculous amount of space away. That was not a good sentence. Good job, Kylie. Thank you. Um, okay, other than this wall, but I'm thinking outside of the farm. That's the nearest wall, which is so far away. That's ridiculous. Okay, what we are going to do, though, is... Let's see here. How many walls do we have? So, we only have two walls on this side. So we're going to go ahead and get this wall built. Can we not build this wall? Do we really have to get rid of one of these trees first? That's so dumb. We can't build this wall yet. That's annoying. Okay, we're going to go over here. We're going to go ahead and upgrade our campsite again. So we should get, yeah, wood walls around us, which I don't think we'll upgrade our walls because they're already upgraded. Yeah. 
So if you upgraded your campsite to that and you still had lower tier wood walls here, it would automatically upgrade them for you. And we also got the Ho Dude. Awesome. Hello, Ho Dude. Thank you. Our Ho Dude will turn us into a pimp, which will then allow us to make farmland. But we still need to, before I'm going to build a farm or anything like that, I want to get more defense up around it. So what the farm is going to do is it's just going to give us another source of income outside of the archers. And it's definitely more reliable. Uh, as far as I know, every single day, the farmers will give you money where, like I said, I think I said this earlier, that archers, as you get further into the game, will become less reliable. Uh, so farmers are just kind of like more reliable than the archers in later on game. And they also give you just a crap ton more money. Can we really not build here yet? Do we need to build the archer tower first? Maybe that's what we need to do. We have to build the archer tower first. Huh. Okay, well, either way, I'm going to wait until it is daytime. So that way my builders do not get mauled by the monsters. We're going to go ahead and get this guy a bow because he's just kind of walking around twiddling his thumbs. And then during the day, let's see here. So do I have a wall out here? I don't think I have a wall. No, I don't have anything out here. So what I'm going to do, because all of my walls, I believe, are two-tier wood, and I can't upgrade them right now, I think what I'm going to do is once it becomes daytime, I'm going to go all the way to the left, as far as I can go, and I think, yeah, I'll go to the left. It could be on the right or the left, so I'm just going to go with the left. Were there really no, there was no monsters today? That's interesting. Okay, we're going to go out here. We're going to upgrade this. I still can't build this wall. It's so irritating. So we're going to have to wait to build that wall for later tomorrow. But we're going to run this way. And what we need to find to be able to, oh. Who are you? Thank you? Who are, what? <laughs> Why is there so much money? What happened? I don't even know where that person came from. That was so weird. I've never seen that happen before. But basically, we need to find this little shrine thing. And we need to pay money to the shrine to be able to upgrade our walls to stone. So that's what I'm hoping to find. We will pick up these villagers as well. Come to my kingdom. Actually, did I upgrade? Did that guy go? I don't know. I don't care. He's walking in that direction, so I'm going to assume he did. Uh, but we need to find this little shrine, and we need to upgrade it from wood to stone. Here is a shrine, but it's not the shrine that I want. There is, actually, there's three different shrines in this game. There is one for builders. Ooh, do I want to go this way? I'm going to keep, I'm going to go to the right again. So, that was a portal, and that is where the monsters come out of. So, I want to just keep away from that for now. There are ways that you can go past it that are pretty easy, but I just don't want to bother with it. Because I think the shrine that I'm looking for should be in front of the portals, which means it should be to the right then. But like I was saying, there are three different kinds of shrines. There are one for builders, there are one for archers, I think, and I think it turns them into like knights or something. And then there are uh, the one for upgrading the walls to stone. And that's the one that we're looking for. The archer one or the knight one or whatever. I've just heard about it. I've never actually seen it before. Can we upgrade this now? What is life? Why can I not upgrade this? <laughs> I don't understand why you no know, let me upgrade. Maybe I need to upgrade this again? I don't know. I definitely want to get stone walls. Oh, thank you for the money. Thank you for the money. Uh, but I, yeah, I've never messed around with the knight slash archer shrine. And I've never really seen what it does. But I've heard that it turns them into knights or something. But I'm not sure how accurate that was. Um, this could be a bad idea going this way. Because it is getting closer tonight. But can we run? There we go. I just want to find the shrine. I want to be able to upgrade my walls. I'm pretty sure... Oh, here's the the donkey dude again. Take my money. Take my money. Give me things. Okay, here's another shrine. This is the night shrine. Uh, I might... Oh, here it is. Here it is. Okay, we need to fill this and then get out of here. Because it is getting night time. We're not even going to watch it. Because I just need to get out of here. So we can build stone walls now. Which is what we're going to be doing tomorrow. And the reason that we want to get stone walls as soon as possible is because... Every fifth night or so, and I don't even know what night we're on. I think this is the third night.
night? It might be the fourth night, actually. Um, but every fifth night, I believe it is, there is a blood moon. And if you've ever played any type of game that has blood moons in it, you know that is not good. Okay, it is not the blood moon. That is very good. Uh, so we'll be upgrading things to stone today so that way we can prepare for that. But basically, there's just like a huge, huge, huge horde of enemies that come. And you just want to be very prepared for the blood moon. And it doesn't seem that there's any monsters that came or maybe they already took care of them. Because it's like midnight. Oh god, get out of here. Get out of here. I do want to upgrade that archer tower. I really, I really want to upgrade this. And I don't know why it won't let me upgrade it. Let's go ahead and upgrade this. Maybe? I feel like I'm upgrading that too soon. Um, but we'll upgrade that. See if it'll let me build another wall. I've never ran into that issue before where it just won't let me build the wall. Maybe I need to get rid of another tree. We're gonna get rid of another tree. And we can make catapults here. So the arrows will point to which which side of the wall it's going to. But honestly, like catapults aren't really that great. And later on, they can be used against you. So I'm not gonna make a catapult right now. No catapults for me. Here comes the donkey dude. We're gonna go ahead and get our exterior walls upgraded to the tier one stone i don't think we'll have enough time to get them to tier two stone today but tier one stone is definitely better than tier two wood i said tier too many times and can i up oh thank you okay put a wall there put the wall there do i have any extra people right now i do i don't really typically i typically wouldn't get three builders at this point in the game but I just need to upgrade so many things today that I'm going to get another one. So go build things. Oh, we got house. Yes. The donkey dude gave us house. Yes, we're now a pimp. Uh, but we still need to make a farm, which we haven't gotten to yet. I don't know that we'll get to a farm today. We'll probably do that next episode. Uh, but we got tons of house. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Hose is like the best thing that you can hope that that donkey dude will give you. Because hose are five coins each, which is ridiculously expensive. Okay, get that wall made pronto. And then, I don't- do I want to try to upgrade more of my walls? I might want to. Let's, uh, make this arch tower. Stat. Make the arch tower quickly. And make that archer tower. I actually, I didn't realize that I haven't made like any towers yet, which is not that great. Um, I think we should be safe though. We got our stone walls, which is great. Uh, I don't think, ooh, I'm not going to upgrade any more walls. I'm not going to risk it. I have decent walls. They could be a little bit better. But they definitely could be worse as well. Uh, do I? I don't think I have any extra people. Because the extra people that I had, they are now <laughs> hoes. So, um, hopefully our archers do well. I think tonight is the blood moon. So we're going to cross our fingers that they don't get through our walls. They might. But one thing that you can do is that you can just throw money at them. And they will take the money and just run away. So if things get bad, that's what we're going to do. It is stormy and cloudy, so I really can't tell if it's a blood moon or not. I'm kind of feeling like it's not, actually. Maybe it's not? Are you not a blood moon? I don't know. There's no one coming, so it kind of makes me feel like it's not. Oh, no, it's a blood moon. It's definitely a blood moon. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, it's a blood moon. No. Okay, let's see here. I'm just going to keep running back and forth and kind of checking how things are going. Because typically, a horde will mostly just come from one side. So if I can throw coins down, which I'm actually going to do right now. Oh, I should do it this way. Oh god, oh god, oh god, just throw all the coins. <laughs> just take my coins and leave me alone. Okay, and you can see that got rid of a couple of them. Where are all of our archers? They're like, oh god, oh god, no, no, grab the crown. 
And in this game, I don't know if I've really even explained that yet. In this game, if you lose your crown, you die. Or it's game over. You don't actually die, but it's just game over. Oh my god, where are all of our archers? Are they just like... Sitting around with their thumbs up their butt? Okay, it's daytime, but they're still over here. They got through one. Oh no, they're taking the hose! Don't take the hose! <laughs> God dang it. Okay, we got two archers on this. Oh, Jesus. No! Crown! No! Thank you. <laughs> Get oh my God, this is a mess. They're taking my hammers. Can you- oh, okay, he's done. Can you uh, grab him? Kill him. Kill him. Kill him. You suck. You're terrible. You're awful archers. Well, that didn't go how I wanted it to go. <laughs> I'm pissed that they took all of my hoes. God dang, I was so excited about those hoes and they're all gone now. But I still have four people that have them, so it's all good. But that's going to be it for today. Uh, yeah, I hope you enjoyed Kingdom. There's definitely going to be more episodes, but that's going to be it for today. Thank you for watching this episode of Let's Play Kingdom. Please like and subscribe and all that stuff. And thank you. Goodbye.